everybody, Molly O'Dell here from OTV. Today may be one of my favorite OTVs we've done so far. We are at Camp Reach for the Sky, sponsored by the Shawnee Foundation, which is a camp for children that have cancer and their siblings. It's a completely free camp for the kids. The kids are having so much fun, so I'm gonna have a really hard time pulling them away from their activities, but I'm looking forward to talking to them, some parents here, some of the volunteers, and just learn about how great this camp is. Make sure you stay tuned. This camp here, we see a whole bunch of young kids, and this is the five to eight. What, what's the age range here? As low as four, but then up to about eight years old. Okay. And these are both kids who've been diagnosed with cancer, so they're patients. Uh, they may be in remission, they may be still in the middle of treatment, and then it's the siblings of those kids as well. Uh, all of our camping, uh, room and board, all the activities that you see here, busing to get up to the campgrounds, all of that is covered through donations that go to the Shawnee Foundation, and there is no expense to the families whatsoever. Sean uh, was somebody who was a teenager who had cancer, and he signed up to go to our camp uh, before he passed away, and he was never healthy enough to actually make it to camp. Uh, but he and his family started the Shawnee Foundation uh, before he passed. So Sean, uh, at 16, came down with a terrible bone cancer called Ewing sarcoma. And he and I, we started the Shawnee Foundation because he wanted to give back, connect with kids who had cancer, and try to come up with some ideas to help people out. What's been your favorite thing so far? Jumping in the pool, um, hiking, out of here and like walking around. So tell me, what are you doing here at camp? Uh, just out here supporting a good cause. Uh, it's something that I've really wanted to be involved in. Uh, finally took the chance and it's my first time and can't wait to come back next year. I just fell in love with the Shawnee Foundation and all that camp does here and I wanted to give back so that's why I decided to come out here for the first year and I've been having such a blast. I'll be back for many years to come. I had brain cancer when I was 13 and I was um, I, I finished treatment when I was 14. I went through chemo, radiation, and surgery, and I went through all the works, and now I'm good. I'm ready to go off to college and have a, like, a great time. All right, so as this is happening right now, there is a bunch of kids behind me, and they're all getting lined up to go to these food trucks, and they all get to pick what they want, and it's all donated. So all the kids get to go have sliders for free, they get to have smoothies for free, or shaved ice. So you tell me first and foremost about your son that I just learned is in remission, so congratulations. Thank you. He had a rare, they're all rare when you're pediatric cancer, but it's called um, embryonal rhabdomyosarcoma, which is a mouthful. But it's basically a solid tumor. So even though your son's in remission, your kids still get to come to camp completely free? Absolutely. Yes, oh all three of them. Yeah, it's a really unbelievable and, and, and quite a gift that we get to come to the Shawnee Foundation, Camp Reach for the Sky. We've been, this is our fifth year. Cameron, what has your favorite thing been at camp? Um, in the water. In the water? What have you been doing in the water? Me and my friends, we did water balloons. It's one of the big focuses is, is to provide sort of a normal week of camp, if you can call this normal, <laughs> uh, but to not focus on the cancer and, and to, to give them the opportunity to meet kids that are going through the same things that they are. And, and there are times where kids will meet up with other kids and they'll start talking about their experience, but the focus really is on just having a good time for the week. It really is a very special experience that I haven't seen any place else. So I think that there, there's something about the Shawnee Foundation's Camp Reach for the Sky, that they, they really get it about how to help kids have experiences and memories that they're gonna remember forever. All right, as I'm wrapping up my interviews here, I cannot adequately put into words the emotions that I'm feeling, knowing that 60% of the kids here are suffering from cancer. When they're running around and screaming and having so much fun and all the joy that I've actually got from being at this camp for the short amount of time, um, I want to say thank you so much to the Shawnee Foundation for inviting us out here today. We are absolutely honored to be here. And make sure you're tuning in to more of our segments and log on to oakwoodtv.tv. Have a great day.